sockets and ports. So pretty much we can imagine that when we get the data, so imagine that our machine right here with operating system and for running processes getting the data from the internet, we will need to be able to tell which application the machine, so which process has to actually receive the data because well, we send it to the network interface card, it sends it to the OS and the OS has now to decide which process has to actually receive the data. And to do that, people designed a certain concept called the port number, which is just a unique number that is given to an application that establishes a network connection. So for example, if P1 is an MMO game and P2 is a banking application, then well, if the traffic is related to some damage taken from a player in MMO game, then the traffic also has the data about the port number. And from that, we'll be able to tell that the application, which is the MMO game, has to actually get the data about the damage and not the banking application. So this is the OS level thing to distinguish the exact process that we need to use for the given data. But also there's the socket. And the socket is actually a combination of the port that we just talked about and an IP address. Because we actually need to be able to tell if we send the data to the correct machine. So we need to know the destination IP address. And also we need to know the process port number because we need to know if the machine is correct and the process is correct to actually send the data to the correct thing. So the socket is just the combination of those two concepts, IP and port. So that would be pretty much it. Thank you for watching. Cheers.